Yeah, good stuff. You know, Jimmy was so good early uh, that he allowed us to make some mistakes late. You know, he got us deep into the seventh inning, and I was going to let him go back out there, but we had that long inning where we scored a couple, and we left a couple guys on, and they made a pitching change, and all of that meant for Jimmy sitting here in the cold after throwing 105, uh, we decided to make a change there, and it was a good thing Jimmy was really good early and allowed us to make a couple mistakes later in the game. Taylor was seeing the ball very well. Four RBI, he got a good pitch to hit where I thought they might put him on base, and he put it in the gap. Yeah, you know, they, they threw him breaking balls all day, and uh, I think three of his hits were on breaking balls. Good for him. Coach, what did it say about the team that you able to come back after giving up that, that lead? Well, both teams. I mean, it says a lot about both teams. That's what you got in this league. You got two teams fighting it out. Uh, you know, Vegas played exactly the same way we did. They got behind, they fought back, they got the lead, and then we did the same to them. That's two good teams getting after it. One of the wackier games you've been involved in with the way things happened down the stretch? Yeah, because it was a... a tournament game you know you might say that but uh, we've been in a few like that I'm sure they've been in a few like that and uh, you play it till the end you know and both teams do that we've played them seven times this year and it seemed like everyone was a barn burner How important is this opening game? Uh, you got to stay in the winner's bracket you know now we got a shot uh, tomorrow uh, if we're fortunate enough to win tomorrow we'll take over the number two seed and then we're on our way